Hello, I'm Phil Marks, the Mayor of the City of Belmont, and I'd like to give you an update on some of the decisions made at this month's Council meeting. At this month's meeting, Council considered an application for a change of use from showroom to animal care services under the local planning scheme. This was supported and will allow a new pet grooming business to operate from a property at Leak Street in Belmont. The approval is subject to a number of conditions, including limiting the number of employees on site at any one time and managing the available car parking bays to accommodate staff and customers. Council also considered a proposal to advertise an amendment to the local planning scheme to recode eight locks from R20 to R40 within the development area 7 precinct that would bring it into alignment with the local structure plan which was previously advertised and adopted in 2013. Advertising of the amendment will enable us to seek feedback and input from the community about this proposed change. All supported by Council, this month were three applications for rate exemptions affecting 20 properties from three organisations who met the criteria that they are being used for charitable purpose under the Local Government Act 1995. I am pleased to report that the City of Belmont has set industry standards in six community and four business service areas in this year's annual survey of residents and business owners. A record number of responses were received. The 2021 Community Perception Scorecard Survey of Residents and Business Owners has again shown the City leading in a number of areas, as well as identifying community priorities. The city's overall performance index score is 70 out of 100, three index points above the industry standard for Western Australia. The survey shows a 91% positive rating for residents satisfied in the city as a governing organisation and 95% positive rating for residents satisfied with the city of Belmont as a place to live. The city is also an industry leader in value for money from council rates, achieving an 85% positive rating. Higher scoring areas included Belmont Hub, library services and playgrounds, parks and reserves. Areas showing the most improvement included history and heritage, animal management, youth services and facilities, and families and children's services. The survey also identified priorities the community would like the city to focus on. These included streetscapes, trees and verges, safety and crime prevention, vandalism and antisocial behaviour, lighting of streets and public places, managing responsible growth and development, traffic management on local roads and waste collection services. We will now further analyse the results to identify opportunities to work with state government agencies on the concerns raised in relation to crime prevention and street lighting, for example, which are WA Police and Western Power issues respectively. The city's 14th annual Let's Celebrate Festival presented by Live Lighter has been a great success with many highlights including Big Light Out, performances in the park and two street parties, Celebrate Cambrang and Belvedere Street Party. Our final community event for the year is Carols in the Park. Come along to Faulkner Park on Friday, 10th of December, to celebrate the festive season. To book your free tickets, visit the City's website. To read more about City's decisions and to keep up to date with what's happening in your City, please visit our website and our social media channels, including Facebook and Twitter. Thank you and stay safe.